one Genesis writer here, and I wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update on where I've been and what I've been doing. Um, normally when a YouTube channel goes by and it doesn't upload content for over a month, people start asking questions and that started to happen on my channel. So I just want to reassure you of where the channel is going and I also want to let you know some of the content I want to be producing in the future. But more importantly, I want to let you know why I've been taking this break. Um, some of you may know already and may be very familiar with the fact that Halo the Master Chief collection, the collection of Halo 1, 2, 3, and 4 on the Xbox One, released with some major, major issues. And even 100 days after the game was released, there are still major issues in the game that for most people make the game almost unplayable or to the point where most people don't play the game consistently whatsoever. Um, I'd like to say that I've played the game pretty consistently, but that's mainly due to the fact that I have some people uh, playing with me in the game who uh, really motivate me to play and who I really look forward to getting on and playing with. Um, so that's a huge blessing, but I'm sure a lot of other people don't, and therefore they don't get on the game and play that much. Um, and I think this topic has been bludgeoned to death uh, so much right now on YouTube that I find it very difficult to produce content talking about Master Chief Collection in an honest way without just adding to the beating of the dead horse that has already happened for quite some time now. I don't feel like by... I don't feel like on one side I'm feeling honest at all if I'm producing a content and acting like the game is working perfectly and I'm having a great phenomenal time playing it, not to say that I haven't had some very good times playing it, but there are just some days I get on and the game won't work. It won't let me play and it's very, very frustrating considering that I really love this franchise and I really love this game series and it's what I make this YouTube channel about. And um, on the other side of the spectrum, I don't want to be openly, brutally honest because uh, I would just start to rail against the game. I would just start to rant and rave and go on and on and on and on and on and probably be a little bit more constructive than a lot of people I've seen on YouTube talk about the game. But uh, the bottom line is the Master Chief Collection is not letting me create content in the way that I would like to and this is really really difficult on me and I didn't know how difficult it would be I didn't know how difficult it would be to switch gears which in the past even in my life in different areas I've had trouble doing and I'm well aware of this um, so I appreciate your support from you guys a lot but uh, there's a specific aspect of the Master Chief Collection that I wanted to mention as a major problem in me trying to upload content um, on my own time and in my own way. Many of you may know that I really like to do in-depth commentary and analysis over theater mode films of Halo gameplay. Now, adding on to the fact that Halo Combat Evolved and Halo 2 Classic inside the Master Chief Collection do not support theater mode, and the upload studio, I believe, only goes to 5 minutes and records at 720p 30 frames per second on the Xbox One. These are not mediums with which I can accurately record a, the uh, a gameplay and then commentate over it easily and show you point by point, even in pulling into a third-person camera, what I want to show you. Many of my videos are geared towards uh, helping an average-level player uh, really see those moments and areas in their gameplay and in my own gameplay where that that mental game is played and I really like to delve into that in a lot of detail in my videos the videos that I cre enjoy creating the most frankly and unfortunately in the Master Chief Collection not only are the file share systems not working when it comes down to theater mode films you cannot post theater films to your file share but on top of that, as I've just me me briefly mentioned, only Halo 2 Anniversary, Halo 3, and Halo 4 have theater mode available for them. And in that case, you cannot save theater mode films to your hard drive. Now let me break it down for you. What that means is that 
when you play games, they go into your temporary history, and your temporary history only lasts for a certain amount of time. And if you're playing a lot of games, like I try to, uh, that 15 or 20 films that builds up in your uh, temporary history, that's all gone in a day. And those films are cycled out for the new ones you've just played, and you can't go back and get into that theater mode film and pull in the third person and show all those nitty-gritty details that I normally like to. And um, just to be clear, the point I just stated, that this problem with the Master Chief Collection that I just mentioned is one of a lot of problems with the game. And to say a lot is dramatically understating uh, the seriousness of the fail that 3 for 3 has produced here. And um, I am hopeful for Halo 5 mainly because of the beta that seemed to work a lot better than the Master Chief Collection and just worked a lot more smoothly. I'm going to hold back on a lot of my thoughts on Halo 5, especially for this video, because I don't want to throw anything too in-depth here. I have a lot of thoughts. I'm mainly just trying to get you guys to understand where I'm coming from and what I've been doing. Uh, some of the things I've been doing in, in uh, the meantime, I've been uh, really exploring streaming. Um, unfortunately, the Elgato and Open Broadcast software application that is available on my Mac computer, uh, they are only updated uh, not as frequently as the PC versions of those same software. And what that means is that I am essentially getting uh, the last crumbs of uh, whatever I need to get. I don't know where I was going with that analogy. Uh, for streaming, it means I'm getting the uh, updates at much a later time than PC users. And this is, you know, I'm trying to work through this. I'm trying to get to where I can stream better on a more consistent basis. I'm not promising anything as, whereas that's concerned. And I'm not promising uh, uploads to YouTube at a consistent basis. You, if you'll notice, I've taken down the I upload a video every week thing. Now, would I like to get back to that? Absolutely. But I'm not going to sit here and tell you that the Master Chief Collection is uh, working out great and yeah things are amazing right now because uh they're really not and i really i didn't anticipate how much of a toll this would take on my motivation levels and um you know i appreciate whatever support you guys can give me if you guys have your own stories leave them in the comment section down below um i just wanted to let again let you guys know where i've been what i've been doing this is a pretty informal video and i'm aware of that um, I just feel like it's, you know, I don't want to drag you guys through excuses, and I want to be upfront and realistic about where the game that I mainly put on this channel has gone and what I'm looking forward to, Halo 5, in the future. And uh, I hope to be getting back to my normal upload schedule, and I hope you guys stick with the channel, and uh, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. It, more than you guys could know. So I'll see you guys in the next capture or whatever in a recording. Peace.